Well. This message is for one person. Cheyenne, Shy, Shy Town. I got gas. She she made fun of me for having a almost an empty tank when I posted a video of a fire happening on our military base. So yeah. What is this? What is this? It's a... Uh... Designer. I can't really see me, but... Going for an overnighter. Lake Berryessa. So, I'll see y'all there. Got the paddleboard. Got bag one, and I'm getting bag number two right now. So. Mashed potatoes. I might go to the store and get some more food. I don't know. Yeah, trying to get there before the sun sets. It's my gear. No, I need to get my gear hanger too. So. Yeah. Here we go. Losing daylight pretty quick, but we're here. So I'm thinking about taking the whole paddleboard backpack with me. And yeah, yeah, I'm gonna take the whole, I'm gonna take the whole backpack with me, so now I'm taking three bags. I wasn't planning on doing it, but. It makes sense. I think it makes sense. How you doing? Good. Yeah, I want to paddle out, go camping. getting rough. The wind's getting rough. Yeah, it is. Down here like two months, so see how low the water got now. Oh, 
All right, man, you take care of yourself. Thank you. Water is much lower than it was back when I came over here. Check. All right, we are here. Forgot. This area sinks to the ground, so. Sleep system is in there. Let's go set that up before anything else. Hello. Well, I even bring my gear hanger. Damn it, True, what the hell is wrong with you? What's happening? What's happening? Y'all can see I'm still awake. So check this out, y'all. Temperature is supposed to be in the 50s tonight, but feels like it's in the 70s. It feels so amazing. 
Sleeping bag. Just chilling. Look at my background. I don't know if y'all see that. Oh, that's the background. It's beautiful, though. No, my lord. It is so warm, and this thing. That right there, I don't know if y'all see that, but that right there, it works. It works. I love it. I mean, I've used it before, but I love that thing because there is nothing flying around me, which is amazing. Now, when the wind comes, it's going to suck, but it's all good. I just put a fresh one in here. Sunrise is in. I think sunrise around 6 a.m. So I'm gonna try to wake up and record sunrise for y'all. But it's 11 something at night. It's time to go to sleep. God bless y'all. Good night. What's going on, you guys? It is currently. time it is. Pretty warm. It's a lot warmer than I was expecting for tonight, but I woke up. For some reason I woke up, but I was sleeping really good. Very good. And I woke up to just seeing the stars. It's gorgeous out here. Not getting bit up, which is nice. Uh, on some Murphys, and uh, my thing is still going pretty good. So, now it's trying to get windy. Here comes the wind. So, yeah. Three something in the morning. Still listen to the Bible Experience, which has been a great story. It's been great, you know, to listen to the Bible. Ain't nothing better than being a hammock, I tell you that much. Ain't nothing better than being a hammock. Anyways, y'all, going right back to sleep. God bless. Take care. Stars are so amazing right now. This is
absolutely what you want to wake up to. <laughs> All I have to do is take the gas to get out here. That's all I do. I want to take a little nap. I want to the sunrise. when people text you or uh, people are like good morning you like good morning good morning at least you know city life this right here is a good morning I look I look rugged I look really rugged but you know what I don't care I look this it's amazing right Sunrise. Got the sunrise. Beautiful sunrise, y'all. Now let's cook some food. It's already cooking, actually. I saw glass here. I've been walking around barefoot this whole time. How smart is that of me? This is one thing I ain't worried about. I'm used to weekend trips. You know, I go out for a weekend, hike around. But packing food for a week in between cities or whatever I'm nervous about that one like my brain thinking that's a lot of dehydrating I need to do <laughs> but crazy since a few minutes right before the sun uh, came out. Stop hearing the fish jumping. So next time I bring a fishing pole, throw it out at five o'clock. I'll get some catches. And I can make some fish.
that. Repellent 
in my bag. I don't know if y'all can see that. I can't tell. But right now, I want to put the stuff in the uh, um, paddleboard and want to get ready to get out of here. So, to the paddleboard. Where, where's my hat? I don't know where my hat is. Hats, hopefully, the paddleboard. Oh, I got shoes on. Yeah, no oh, take a look. Can y'all see that? So see what I mean by the angle? And maybe a tent can go there. Maybe. Winds was strong from the south, and now we're having northwest winds, which is nice. It's going to be an easy way home. So what I did was, I beached right there since the wind is coming from the south. And I went on and put the anchor down because I really thought that the wind would have took the paddle board last night. That's how windy it was. And then it calmed down and I just went to sleep and stuff. But yeah, it was windy. Windy. Like there are waves here at the lake. And I've never, I've, many times as I've actually came to the lake and camped out here, well, it's a big old fish. That's a big fish. Many times I've been here camping and just came to the lake, I've never seen waves here. So, I ain't gonna lie, that wind, the surf from the wind, I kind of felt like I was one too. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Yep. Sunrise is so gorgeous, y'all. I absolutely loved it. It's already warm. My speakers came on. It's already warm. Like, I'm starting to sweat. Like, since the sun been up, the temperature probably went up a good 10. I mean, it has to be in the 70s right now. It has to be. There's my anchor. Oh. Got it. I had it like underground. Out of work. This water, y'all. basically I'm going to go back that way I'm going to go down that channel and or down that cove and head back to the car